pushing. We're out. We're in the way. Oh, we're in the way? Yeah, they're coming. They're they're making a lap around. Closer, take some pictures. Right. Don't make any attempts to talk to your soldier, you know, talk to him or anything like that. We have plenty of time for that today. After the family day ceremony, which starts at 09 at Pomeroy, you'll have plenty of opportunities to talk with them throughout the day. They'll be released to you. But for this morning, we need them to be under the control of the drill sergeants and everything. We will allow you guys to move forward and take some pictures of them. And just to orient you guys to the formation. Huh? Are you sure? Are you sure? Are you 100% sure? 100% sure? Really don't want to go Ready? Quick! Your head hang naturally. Your head hang naturally. Don't hold it up. Don't hold it up. Let it hang. It's your 4 night 8 frame. It's him. You know, should not be touching the ground, weirdo. It's you. Weirdo with the haircut. Weirdo with the haircut. Your fingers are still together. That hasn't changed. Come here. That means move them out of the sand a little bit. Like you're going to be out of the sand. Out of the sand. Move. Show the tension. Move. One, two. What is on the 
second row in the middle. Right him, he's like directly behind the guy. Like not directly behind the guy. Okay. Got it. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the invocation given by Chaplain Drew Turner. And Standing before you is the first sergeant and drill sergeants of Foxtrot Company, 2nd Battalion, 47th Infantry Regiment. These non-commissioned officers represent everything that is great about the Army and our society. The knowledge and experience they instill on a daily basis is saving lives on the battlefield as we speak. I would like to take this opportunity to introduce these great Americans. Please hold your applause until the introductions are complete. The senior non-commissioned officer of the company is First Sergeant Timothy Beavis from Riverside, California. From First Platoon, the senior drill sergeant is Staff Sergeant Seth Houle from Urbina, New York. Drill Sergeant Kevin Lacombe from Knoxville, Tennessee. Drill Sergeant Calvin Bonner from Augusta, Georgia. From 2nd Platoon, the Senior Drill Sergeant is Staff Sergeant Dane Norris from Pickneyville, Illinois. Drill Sergeant Daniel Walker from Austin, Texas. And Drill Sergeant Robert Forbes from Miami, Florida. From 4th Platoon, the senior drill sergeant is Sergeant First Class Bobby Summers from Washington, North Carolina. Ladies and gentlemen, tomorrow's graduation ceremony begins at 9 a.m. at the National Infantry Museum. There is also a family panel that takes place inside the National Infantry Museum, first floor conference room at 8 a.m. All family members of the graduating soldiers are encouraged to attend. Cadre family members will be there to answer any questions or concerns. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of our battalion commander, Lieutenant Colonel Dwayne Patton, the battalion command sergeant major, command sergeant major Thomas Morgan, and the Foxtrot Company family, we would like to thank you for attending today's ceremony. Please check your area for any personal belongings and trash. May God bless you all. Please drive safely and enjoy your day with your soldiers. She being shy. You see all the, you see all the soldiers. Huh? 
There you go.
50 years, the musicians of the United States Army Maneuver Center of Excellence Band have taken great pride in entertaining the soldiers, families, and civilians of the Fort Benning, Columbus, and Phoenix City communities. Through music, they've shared the story of our nation and its soldiers worldwide.
Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the arrival of the official party. Remain standing. Ladies and gentlemen, Chaplain Turner will now give the invocation. Would you please join me in prayer? Join their strength, conduct a military ceremony. In the American Army, we were two British and Allied and very friendly and not stupid. We were able to practice our revolutionary soldiers. We were able to consider four stages the formation of troops, the application of arms, inspection, and the march on the view. Today, we are going to perform an additional stage to the arms of the nation and the heart. The presence of the band represents the country and all the drum fights and all the music. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise and move your hats for playing the national. The drill song free. I am the drill song. I will assist each individual in their efforts to become a highly motivated, well disciplined, physically and mentally fit soldier, capable of defeating any enemy on today's modern battlefield. I will instill pride in all I train, pride itself, in the army, and in country. I will insist that each officer meets and maintains the only standard of military merit and courtesy, consistent with the highest position of the U.S. Army. I will lead by example, never requiring a soldier to attempt any task I will not do myself. But first, last, and always, I am an American soldier, sworn to defend the Constitution of the United States against all enemies, foreign and domestic. I am the drill sergeant. This will defend. 
receiving the award for Soldier of the Cycle with Specialist Brendan Dickinson from South Hadley, Massachusetts. And to you, we supporting us with Distinguished guests, and most importantly, families and friends of Fox Company 247 Amateur. This is truly a life-changing day for 161 great Americans and their families. These young men have completed basic combat training and now take their place in the profession of arms. At a time in our country where only one in four young men meet the minimum requirements to join the United States military, your soldiers have raised their right hand and sworn to defend something bigger than themselves. The decision to join the Army has never been one that's made lightly. But doing so while the nation is at war is a testament, not just to their courage, but the support you have given them. So to all of you, I want to say thank you. First, for entrusting our Army with the precious lives of your sons, brothers, fathers, husbands. And second, for the love and encouragement you've given them that's brought them this far. For the sacrifices you've already made, to the support of your soldier, please give yourselves a round of applause. <laughs> this day would not have been possible without the outstanding drill service you see before you. The transformation from citizen to soldier is not an easy process, so the changes these drill sergeants make in the lives of your young men in 10 short weeks is simply amazing. Many of these changes are probably visible when you're re reunited with your soldiers yesterday at family day. Drill sergeants, you amaze me with your tireless commitment to duty and your passionate dedication to the young lives like these. Thank you for what you've done for these soldiers and for the sacrifices you and your families make for our country every day. Let's hear it for the drill sergeants.
Ladies and gentlemen, please rise to play the Army song. Right there, you guys. Oh, oh. 